Hey, y'all. So I wake up probably like, I was trying to, res okay. Y'all know I got a bitter ass baby father. And that I stole, I be a hundred, bro, you're supposed to be in jail, bro, already. First, you didn't expose my son. Kidnapped him 4 a.m. In, in, in the morning. Taking him out of his bed with no covers, no nothing. He's just in socks and not even buttoned up right. Um, you just, you're just doing cry outs for help. So I, I try to meet you halfway. I, I, I try to go to, go in your house, fill up. If I ever did decide to leave my kid with y'all, do I? I don't even have to watch out her. It's Blueface. Blueface is the issue. He's the weirdo. He's the predator of this whole situation for real, for real. And then he got it when she's not even like, like, you know what I'm saying? It, it got nothing to do with her. That That's the, that's the, that's the weirdo. Got nothing to do with nobody but me and my baby daddy. And his weird ass got just jealousy issues. So, you know what? I'm like, you know, moving my little, um, you know how I'm moving. I'm moving my own little way right now. Like, all right, I'm having my way for real. Like, I got we know story short, it's 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 hurting blue face. Like it's breaking his little heart. So this weird ass studio, and I'm doing what I'm doing. He can't get in no contact with me. So he go to my house drunk. First of all, you're supposed to be in jail for Exposing my son's penis. You're supposed to be in jail for kidnapping a kid. First of all, don't be kidnapping my child. Then try to, like, go to you. He was trying so hard to get to his house so he can call the cops and say that I'm trespassing and I can't come up in their house because he's just an evil. He even get to his house. We at the gate squabbling up for real. And then I tell him, like, he's abusing the fact that I don't play no police games for real. Like, back in the day when he used to fool and... I hate when, like, I don't like when police get in, they get in your business for real. I'm not really good with the cops no more. Like, you feel me? I didn't. So right now, he know I'm over that police game. So we'll do the police games. It's like, he want me to talk about him again. Like, what do you want from me, bro? Like, he's like, so, uh, the baby's over there with you. The baby's going to be wherever I go. He's going to be protected. He's going to be safe. He going to be with, because when I had a funny feeling, when I left him with Marsh, I power. That's why when she, when, when he woke up trying to take the baby, she was like, you going to take me too. So Krishan get to us because respectfully paid for her. So yeah, um, I got all my control though. That's why I had my baby in Baltimore. That's why I didn't put him on no birth certificate. So still my baby again, respectfully, it's not your child. You know why? Because where's the proof? In spite of that DNA test we took on our TV show, yeah, we have proof. We know this is your kid, but he doing so, so much damage. I had to make sure he wasn't on a birth certificate. I had to make sure I was more in control of the situation because the situation. Because, <laughs> like, I don't know what man will expose their son's penis, kidnap them, get in a car accident. The baby don't got no, it's no... He didn't grab the diaper bag or nothing. He just left the crib. Like, he could just survive on up against. But he's weird. Like, he's he's battling. And he think he's, he think he's hurting me when really he's hurting his son and he's hurting himself. Because I'm over here happy. And he... So I be texting him like, yeah, I love you, bro. Keep going. You got this. Da, da, da. I be trying to motivate him to stay positive because I'm scared to sleep at my house. What else? He kept kicking me. Like, he kept kicking me. These are bruises that's still healing. So when I avoided them all together, I'm like a thief in the knife and stole my baby for more attention. So what I'm thinking is... And he know I'm not playing those police games because I'm trying to clear up my wants right now. I have court. Oh, type, bro. But I swear to God, bro. I'm finna go to the most. Both of us need to be in jail then because it's like, how am I going to protect my son from somebody that's such a threat?
what's up everyone welcome to my channel my name is lean from kenya east of africa and guys you're very welcome to my channel anyway guys i know i've been gone for a minute but i've been back i've actually been attending a wedding of uh, a friend so i'm just here in the coastal regions of nairobi uh in the coastal regions of kenya you all know that i'm from kenya east of africa and guys i'm going to drop some very nice videos afterwards uh i hope you guys will keep up and watch them on my shorts so anyway guys um you just saw that uh video i just uploaded or even from the uh context of what i've given uh this video as the title you can clearly tell that christian rock is not happy you all know that blueface went straight on his ex account previously known as Twitter and say that he just did you know as, as he just did a DNA test as uh, secretively and discovered that uh, Christian jr. is not his biological son and that has sparked a lot of mixed reaction because it has left a lot of people talking in the internet because you know who would have thought that blueface would have you know uh, done a private or else a secretive uh, DNA test to really test if uh, Christian Jr. is his biological son. I don't know what you all think, but please uh, just go ahead in the comment section and tell me do you feel like uh, uh, Blueface uh, getting a secretive DNA test was the right thing to do, or do you think he just overreacted and all that stuff? Anyway, after going ahead and saying that, you know, mm, and saying that he is uh that he just discovered that he's he did a private uh dna test a secretive one without anyone knowing and after doing it uh he said that he discovered that christian jr is not his biological son and he also went ahead and said that he thanks god because you know he has really been uh, uh putting a lot of effort in uh looking at uh helping christian uh raise the baby but you all know christian says that uh she raises his uh, uh her son alone so i don't know what you all think because again uh after uh blueface went ahead and say that christian also went ahead and tweet uh, uh, and posted a tweet saying that you know he's done with blueface and he just wants someone to cut off or uh, to to you know uh, to, he just wants someone immediately to remove all tattoos of blue face on her body anyway i don't know what you all think about that because a few weeks ago i had posted a video where christian was saying that uh she's done with blue face and removing the tattoos but she still didn't remove them so we still don't know if uh she's going to do that but just go ahead also in the comment section and tell me do you think that this time round christian will get done with blue face also now let's uh get in the into the video you just watched christian was just like you know uh talking about about you know blue face always being on uh his neck and all that you know you all know that a lot of people have always waited for an explanation because you all know some few days ago uh blue face went uh to christian's house and uh got the uh, and got the baby saying that christian is still not at home at 4 a.m uh and the baby is alone with someone looking after after him but i don't know what you all think because a lot of people uh went on blueface ne a lot of people you know were so mad because you know blueface is a parent you know he uh he can also look after the baby why does he has to wait for christian to look after the baby and all that stuff so christian was just uh saying what went down she revealed that she was actually uh in the studio making some music and that is when and she had paid actually marsh i guess her long time friend uh who she trusts with her baby and she had paid her a thousand dollars only uh, only for one hour so that marsh could look after christian jr but immediately blueface went there uh blueface took the baby and all that stuff and uh, christian also went ahead and revealed what transpired he said that they went to blueface house and a lot of things went weird and her herself together with Jaden, they destroyed uh blue face uh they, they destroyed uh blue face things and all that stuff and after that 
mm, uh, they talked with Jaden and uh, you know just a lot of things anyway I don't know what you all think because a lot uh, Christian is saying that uh, in this video she also revealed that she's done with Blueface that Blueface should be in jail it's just that she can't take Blueface to jail now because she has a lot of court uh, ongoing court cases so that is why allegedly she can't report Blueface for now because you know uh, she has a lot of pending issues with the police so she don't want to go ahead because she also revealed bruce's healing where blue face had earlier beaten her in all that stuff to be sure from what she said we can clearly say or tell that blue face is a narcissist okay it's not like we can clearly say that you know they don't have a healthy relationship and all that stuff so uh, after that guys uh Christine also went ahead and said that you know mm, everything uh everything concerning his the his son uh, her son is hers because you know the the birth certificate she has never gotten it because uh she wants everything under uh her control and she has control over the baby as for now and all that stuff anyway i don't know what you all think about everything krishan said because you know uh we don't know we don't know so just go ahead in the comment section and tell me that's all for now guys i'll update you with more news